Welcome to the AW Services YouTube channel. A very quick and prompt video with reference to my Roland TR6S video on using batteries versus uh, power supplies, USB, causing and creating interference and hum coming through your audio. I do recommend getting a decent set of quality USB leads. Um, short as possible gold plated if you can get them chroma makes some very good leads and also you can buy ferrite chokes on amazon in different sizes these are a ferrite choke composite like graphite and they block out signal and sound interference and ground lift hum and they fit onto your cable you know ensure your cable and your chokes are sized appropriately i've got a four mil cable so i'm going to need a, a choke that's tight and fits onto that this is the end that goes into the roland tr6s i place that into the choke like so i line it up i'm doing this with one hand so excuse me compress it down tight and then I've got a choke that's attached to my cable, which goes into the back of the TR6S. And then my power supply from my laptop, USB charger, etc. goes like so. And then that in turn should help prevent any noise in the signal. You can also put ferrite chokes on any kind of lead, whether it's power and also, if you're using a mains charger, etc., make sure the circuit that that's coming from is possibly a different ring main to what the actual TR6S is, and then you haven't got linked and associated ground lift noise <clears throat> coming through your power because mains power is AC, which is alternating current, so that will create a sine wave noise. But I hope this video helps. If you found it useful, please subscribe, support the channel, hit the bell icon for notifications, give it a share with your friends. But thank you for watching AW Services.